Hi, and now in this tutorial, we just want to create a spaces, a first look of the spaces, how web center spaces will be. So, we start with the uh, web center, accessing the web center spaces. So, this one web center is already deployed to the server, this location, and this is the URL to access the spaces. So, this is the spaces, and we log in with the uh, admin URL for the first time. So web center spaces comes up with uh, the activities and documents. Spaces and these are all the options that is already available, and these are all the global links like uh, the web admin is a user that is logged in, and these are all the available spaces you can go to the home space, browse through the space, and as well create a space. These are all favorites, and you can add favorites to your profile. And that will be available. Influencers for the user and logout. So this wheel will help us to create a page for a particular user. So let's start by clicking creating a space for the web admin. So let's start with the name the spaces. So this can be a For the hidden people, I will not be appear on the search results. Click next, and here you will find the templates that the space should be based on. So, bloggers can use a blogger template, but if it's want to be a discussion site or a portal site or the project site, so user can be customized the template available here and we'll proceed with creating these spaces. So we have our spaces created for ourselves and this will be the home page that is defaulted. So let's log in to the view. And this is the action uh, menu and you can just manage the menu using all settings. So when you on good all settings, you can configure the resources, navigation and other op options. So the spaces option will give
to do this display name, the description, and the keyword, and other extra operation. The icon that you want to be displayed and the access can be done here on the state and whether you want to close the space here or whether you want to publish RSS. And this section is like for the template that you want to use. For example, if you use Fusion Top Navigation and apply. You'll get the navigation like this, and if you have a uh, sign navigation, uh -huh. go to the space, you'll have the template like this, displayed like this. So you can customize the view of the spaces the way you want to have. You can create your own space, space template, and all other things, whichever is available here. These are resource catalog that you want to use for your space, the navigation, the photo, whether you want to display the photo or not, and the copyright information and the language. So you just have to create and you just create, create apply and then the settings will be saved for your spaces. So the roles tab will let you write the role assigned for the particular user or some of them creating a role, a specific role for the user and other members. Here the members can create a group and you can invite people and all other things can be done here. So this is the thing where if you allow self membership then they can log in and then they can create their own login position and then this is the page that you want to display currently we have the home page is the first one and this is the top of the one and this will be the first that is available in the spaces here you can add multiple pages content other information. You can also create a subspaces for the space and the services can be configured. So whenever you have add services that can be configured from this place. So the main thing here for the spaces is the resources tab. This is called as resource manager template can be added here, navigation, the custom resource catalog, skins, the page tabs, all other looking layouts can be added here. Now go back to You can add the user to it with the information here. Preferences tab, the password, the account, the connection, presents, then come the customers here. That's it for now.